My name is Bill Kleckner. I started sculpting a stone in about 2010. It's not. Actually, what got me into sculpting is my brother-in-law and I had, uh, for fun, taken on a, a tree stump carving project. And because of that, he, he had been into stone sculpting and got me into that. And so that was the beginning. I, my, my inspirations are, are erratic. You, you know, I'm, I'm definitely inspired to, to do beautiful female sculptures, but I, I, I lack a lot of the skills. Faces are very difficult, and I've been working with clay to help with my facial skills. I also am inspired by illumination. I've been to a couple illumination stone sculpting workshops, and as a result of that, I always think about lighting up uh, the stone, and so ultimately it's my intent to, to, to light up some silicaga marble. You, you know, others believe, and I have heard said, and, and I believe it, that, that the work that we do w with stone is, is much more than the finished product. Well, a machine can't do what, what's really significant in sculpting, and, and that's to, to give attention to the stone. And, and, and that is an energy transference. But, but I believe when I took a piece of stone yesterday and, and made it into a shape, I, I have infused that stone w with my energy and my love and my passion. The advice to the novice is that it's the, it's the doing that, you know, you can make a living doing this, but that's not what, what it's about for me. It's just a passion. My, my dream project I, I, is another work in process, and, and it's, a, it's an Italian alabaster. They call it Italian ice, and it's translucent. And, and so, it, you know, it, it's, it's come along, and, and I, I've done a, a, a full clay of the face. And so it's pretty cool to be able to have a life-size face right next to the stone. I hope that, that retirement will give me the opportunity to work more with faces and I'll continue to pursue my passion with illuminating stone. I, I like the colors, you, you know, I, I haven't, I, I've only just played around with, with, with the green and the pink and the brown, and so, so you, you know, there, there's the, the whole uh, commercial a application of it, and we toured the quarry last year, and, and the people were really nice, and it's interesting to, to see the commercial and, and their passion about what, what they do, and, and then, and then to, to see what's been done in Silicaga uh, with, with, with embracing the marble. I, I love it I, when people actually touch sculptures, you know, because a, a sculptor spends hours and hours and hours working on that stone and putting in energy. And this is why Silicaga is so special, ha having people walk by and to be able to interact with the sculptors. It's great. I I'll be back.